Hello, and welcome to Struggle Cooking with Mommy. Here, we try to cook meals with the least amount of effort possible. While perusing the aisles of the high-end store known as Walmart, I found some items that I think you'll be interested in. Let's see. It's the Rapid Ramen. Huh? Rapid Raymond. Rapid. Uh, rapid, okay. So it's not Rapid. It's the Rapid Ramen. No need to spend all that effort making ramen noodles anymore. Now you can just make it in the microwave in one convenient step. Like honestly, this, this is the laziest cooking item in the world. Thanks producers for giving me this beautiful item. It's the world's fastest and easiest way to cook your ramen noodles. While shopping at my local high-end store, Walmart, I also came across another item. It's the Rapid Mac Cooker. Now you can just spend five minutes making your box macaroni and cheese versus 20. Your kids will never know that it's not homemade. Wait, really? Oh, at the office too, okay. No need to use that stove or pots again. That requires too much effort. And here at Struggle Cooking, we're all about taking the struggle out. The Rabbits! Is that too much? We're now in the kitchen, and we're about to try our rapid ramen. No, rapid? Wait. Rapid. 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 We're going to try our rapid ramen with our mint maruchin ramen noodles. Marishan. All right, you got it? Let me get some behind the scenes. For my Snapchat shorty! Let's follow the instructions and deposit it in the rapid ramen cooker. Who measures the water? Do you measure the water? Because I like mine a little dry. We shall be putting two cups of water and we're going to pop it into the microwave and see what we get. Got it? Ugh. It's three minutes! I'm so excited! While our top ramen is cooking, let's go ahead and get our mac Let's go ahead and get our mac and cheese ready. No mirror. I have no idea what I look like. I'm just in this ratchet kitchen in the office. Are you ready? Look, here's our mac and cheese cooker. And it looks like we got Carolina Blue. Go Hornets! Is that right? That's the right thing. It looks like we put in our mac with our water, two minutes and 30 seconds, stir the noodles, mix well and enjoy. Mm. Yeah, got it! Uh-huh. Looks like our raven ramen is ready. Let's take it out. Got a bowl slash plate. Let's pour our rapid ramen in. This looks delicious. We'll just set that aside until our mac and cheese is ready. Ugh, this is too much work. Full water in a medium. How much water? Six cups of water? I'm supposed to put six cups of water in this? Who do they think I am, Martha Stewart? <laughs> Seriously? No. We will add six cups of water to our mac and cheese dry noodles. I was supposed to fill that to the water line. Do not follow the instructions on the box. No one would have told me, guys. Do these hands look like they cook? Look at my nails. Now, we will put this in the microwave for exactly 2.5, 2.3, 2.3, 2.3. Two and a half minutes. Here we go. Okay, so let's go ahead and we're gonna mix this up. Oh, it's a little hot. So I just put my mac and cheese back in the microwave for two more minutes after I stirred up and broken up the chunk. There's that sound. Let's go ahead and check on our rapid mac and cheese. We have soft noodles. Time to add our delicious cheese packet. It's the cheesiest. Now we shall stir it. Your family will have no idea you didn't cook this on the stove. When was I supposed to add milk and butter? Unfortunately, my staff was too lazy to get the milk and butter needed to finish this mac and cheese. So we're gonna eat it just in its powdery form. Look how that's just coming together. You know what it's time for, a taste test. Ah, 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 let's go back on set. We've now entered back into the studio. And unfortunately, I didn't have a clean bowl to put our rapid mac and cheese in because I was too busy slaving away all day on this hot homemade dinner for my family. And I couldn't get to the dishes. But now, it's time for a taste test. I'll start with the rapid ramen. Here we go. Mmm. Taste 
tastes just like homemade ramen. Your family won't be able to tell the difference. Next time you go to cook ramen, skip the pots and pans and save yourself 30 seconds by using the rapid ramen. Is that good? This is legit good though, like seriously. For real though, I ain't gonna lie, they taste like the stove. Now it's time for this delicious mac and cheese. Mmm, just like grandma used to make. We saved ourselves some time by skipping the butter and milk. It made our mac and cheese a little drier, but ain't nothing wrong with that. Let's give it a taste, shall we? Let's redo that. Let's taste it. Just like stove top. Seriously, whoever forgot the butter and milk, you're fired. Officially. This tastes like, literally, look at the chunks. Look at the chunks. Next time you go to make your box mac and cheese, pick up this handy mac and cheese. Pick up the rapid mac and cheese. Pick up the rapid mac and cheese. This literally tastes like toenail shaving. Like with the cheesy fungi still in it, but not the brand. The brand is delicious. I just cooked it wrong. Make sure you don't skip the milk and butter. Like I'm legit about to eat all this. Are we done? Mm. That mac and cheese is the devil. Officially. I'm Mommy Cray Cray. Signing out for. Wait, what show is this? We don't know the name of the show. Is it just Mommy Cray Cray? Hi, Mommy Cray Cray. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. And make sure you beat your subscribe button into submission.